Hi, in this video I will show app for converting how to use app for converting Excel files to SQL file, SQL scripts. Like at my work I'm usually receiving like a lot of um, requests like can you upload this Excel file into SQL server? Uh, can you um, can we convert this Excel list into SQL table? And so I created apps that helps me to do that. And um, I, I'm going to show you how to use it. Um, this is my website. I will leave link on the site into the description. To find the app, I will go to search and um, type XLS to SQL. XLS is like extension of Excel files, especially old Excel files, um, it's like 2000 Excel 2000 files. So. There is an app for converting Excel to SQL, uh, modern Excel file to SQL, but um, in this video I will show how to use old app, uh, app for uh, converting old Excel files. Now, uh, to download app, I'll double click on the load button to start downloading process and click on download it archive. Uh, double click on them assign inside archive and click on more info. I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not a registered publisher. You can see publisher unknown. I'll just click run anyway to start installation. Click on next, next install. Click on yes and click on finish on final screen. And um, you can see that app has been uh, installed on my computer. I have a new shortcut here so I can close this and minimize this screen. And uh, I have a shortcut. Now I can Now, conversion is three steps process. The first step, I have to select input file. Now, for testing purposes, I have this file. Uh, um, I I want I want to show it to you. So there is a file. Um, I I don't have a Excel. It's just Excel Viewer. It's a free from uh, Microsoft. But you can see I have a. Excel file with one, two, three, four, um, four uh, tables, right? One, two, three, four tables, and um, four, four spreadsheet. And when I will convert it, every screen of the spreadsheet will be converted into table. And first row of every table has a column names. These column names will be used for create table instructions. Let's go and uh, convert this file. So I click here to select file, my test, click here. Now if I want to add ID field to the table, I can do that. And also on second step, we are second step now. Because I selected from the first step, click next step, and we are second step. On second step, I will have to select uh, which uh, SQL I want to convert. because. Like there are differences between different databases uh, for SQL database. SQL SQL is slightly different. For my SQL is also there is a differences in SQLite as a difference. So if I want to create script for a specific database, I can select here. So let's click on my SQL Server for Microsoft SQL Server and just click next. And here I can preview. So you can see it creates tables for um, bank info. This is one uh, spreadsheet with certain information. Here is insert instruction. There is a United States and subregions different table, different ID, different values. Insert again. Address is also and sequence. So we have everything, everything here. And now I can click on save result to save this SQL file. And yeah, I can use like um, my test SQL name and click on save into my documents. Click save. And uh, basically that's it. And I can, let's see, I can show you with notepad 
just to show it to you. So it's basically a SQL script file. You, it, should, it will create data table with fields from um, uh, first row for every spreadsheet and insert data in it. So as a result, when I run this SQL script uh, on SQL, I will have four tables with all data from Excel. Uh, or I can run it by myself or I can send it to my DBA and ask him to run it and everything sorted and the data will be there so yeah basically that's it I can also convert multiple Excel files if I want and it will create it will do the same so script will be with uh, create table instruction first then insert with the data and then create table for another and insert with the data yeah basically that's it um, if you have any questions about the app uh, please leave them in comments Thank you.